Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2017 with the Rude Man. And we're back on Texas. In the last episode, I was selling compost and I was finishing the, uh, well, I was finishing the potato field. Let's get on with that. And I was contemplating, uh oh, where'd my trailer go? Um, I gotta fix this. Hang on. Gotta go find a trailer. I swapped out some trailers, what I did. I swapped out, uh, I sold a couple of trailers and bought a thir uh, bought a, uh, another one of those great big long trailers that I was showing you in the last episode, or one of the later episodes. Anyway, I was also contemplating on selling crop to buy a field. The uh, fields here on Texas are very expensive. Uh, millions is what they are. And I'm thinking about getting field 17, which is right above us there. Let me find my new trailer. Where is it? Yeah, let's see here. Let me find that trailer that I was going to replace. God, I got to get some pig food too. All right, let's see where it's at. Okay, there's that one, but where is that one? That's not the one at the shop. So let's find the one at the shop. There's the one at the shop. Let's reset that. All right, and then we'll pick that up. Pick that up. Get this back to the field. And I'm going to sell crops. Uh, I don't have a great need in crops right now except for uh, money, except for selling. Uh, I painted this one red. The other one's yellow. If I get another one, maybe I'll make it green. I don't know. Figure that out when we get there. But I'm going to sell that John Deere combine too. I'm thinking. I'm thinking about that. Because right now I need money more than I need combines. Well, we'll see. I, I don't know why I bought it in the first place. It doesn't match my other equipment. get this guy back to work uh, no course selected this is field 29 is it 29 field 29 right there drive the course all right you go back to work there oh I I hate when these trucks do that it's gonna do it again isn't it no I might go back to my old cat trucks they didn't do that they didn't do that. See what I mean? They didn't do that. Might have to go back to my cat trucks. But that's a story for another for another day. Let me get this guy ready. Do I need to plow? Is my next question. Needs plowing. 28. Uh-oh. Did I say 29? I did. 29 doesn't need to be plowed. Okay, none of my fields need plowing, but yeah, I'm thinking about buying this 17, but I need to get on with selling some crops before I can do that. So, let's see. I've got this guy was selling compost. Let's get him back to work. And then I've got my dump truck and trailer that I can use to sell sell stuff. I just need, I need to find the best prices. I don't think there's any special deals going right now. Nope, I don't see one. Yeah, there's no great demands right now, so I'm going to have to kind of watch the prices. I'll probably start with the uh, with the wheat, and it looks like that's, ooh, that's the best price right there. Works for me. Uh-oh, Kenworth is in the uh, traffic there. Yeah, so eventually I think I'm going to trade these Kenworths. I like the Kenworth trucks, but for some reason, they interfere with the trailers. 
So I've uh, been using the cat trucks on San Diego, and they seem to work a lot better. So I'll probably go back. Oh, my God. Ah, oh, gee. That's what they do. Is this right here? Stuff like this. It's... All right. Ah. Oh. Yeah, the cats aren't doing this kind of thing. Part of it, I know, is the way I drive. I drive too fast. I turn too fast. I turn too sharp. A lot of that stuff. But I do that with the cats, and they don't seem to have this issue. And it's almost like it's worse on Texas than it is on Carmen Santiago, or whatever the name of that map is. So we'll see. I don't have the money to do it now. I, I, The only way I had the money to, to get that other new trailer was I sold uh, uh, two pieces of equipment to buy one. So. All right. Let's see here. We're going to sell the wheat. So let's line this thing up. And see, did I make a sale point? Grain, seed, plow, grass, harvest, straw, cultivate. I didn't make a sale point? Wow. There I did. Grain sales. Right there. Okay. United Supermarket, Mary's. All right. I don't have one to the sell point. So let's make one. And that's what I'm going to do for compost. I'm going to sell my compost and keep making more. Um, this isn't right. This isn't right. Let me straighten this out a little bit. Oh, I'm stuck. No, I'm really stuck. Dang it. How did I do that? I tell you, it sucks being me sometimes. Okay, let me get this thing straightened out. The, the, the trailer is so long. It really is very long. Okay, so get a straighter angle at this. And stop. Okay, so we're going to do a transport course. Start it recording here. Slowly get out onto the road. Scorpion told me he found a mod. That you know the mod that uh, you that is in the game, where you can buy that roller uh, attachment, and you can roll it over the ground and it puts it back to its initial state from the map. Like if it was dirt here instead of gravel, and I ran that thing over it, it would revert it back to dirt. Well, somebody made a mod that you can use that same piece of equipment, a modded version of that piece of equipment, but, but you can tell it what you want it to revert to. So in other words, if it's dirt, you could say, I want it to be gravel. Or whatever you want to make it. I haven't uh, got that mod yet. I'm going to look into it, though. He said he's been kind of converting and making gravel roads around Texas here. All righty. Yeah, I might sell that manure place. I don't need this manure place here anymore because I actually made the um, the hayloft able to to hold manure because it didn't before. All right, got that one down. That would give me a little bit more money too because I had to pay money to put that manure uh, place in right there. Since I don't need it anymore, I could sell it, make a little bit more money for the 
land that I want to buy. I want to be a land baron. You know, we don't have ro royalty in America unless you want to, you know, unless Burger King, you know, you might want to consider that royalty, I guess. But we, uh, like, I wouldn't know what a bear, what's the difference between a baron and a count and, you know, a duke and an earl? We know nothing about that kind of thing, except for what we see in movies and on, is in, as in, in books and stuff, so. If I'm a land baron, I have no idea what that means. Except for that maybe I own a lot of land. And it's barren, and I have to plant stuff on it. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just making it up. Stay out of the mud. Oh, I hate that mud. The mud was cool for about five minutes. When I downloaded this version of the map. Let me go long on this one. Make sure I got a straight run. Right there. All right, now I can always make lots of compost. So I think I'm gonna sell my compost first. Let's see here. Uh, we're gonna stop that. Save it. I'm just gonna call it grain, although it's everything, not just grain. To sell point, I just, I call it whatever you want. That's what I'm calling it. And then let's make it uh, compost because I can easily make lots of compost. Oh yeah, yeah, there it is. I put compost in there. Okay. Uh, and then let's just drive the course and see what happens here. Okay, let him go. I want to take my other truck, though. Uh-oh. Oh, I know what happened here. Um, let's see. I need to... This one here. Let's do this at 7.5. That's where people are telling me they're, they're setting this up to 7.5. I'm going the wrong way. People are telling me they're setting this at 7.5 with this equipment and it seems to work okay that way so let's try it uh oh that didn't work let's get this load first i'm going to i'm going to keep some of the of the potatoes because I need potatoes for pig food but I'm gonna sell the majority of it I was gonna stockpile it but I need money right now which reminds me uh, let me go to the garage and sell that manure place I don't need it hang on let me sell uh, the milk trigger yeah, I'm going to sell this too. I don't need it. And then I think I'm in the way. Let me get out of the way. If I'm not out of the way right at the moment, I will be soon. And then let's... Uh, let's go back to the garage. And... There. Don't need that. It's not very much money. It's only $1,400. You know what? For that, maybe I'll just leave it. Just in case, I don't know. I don't really have a need for it. But let's see. Um, that'll give me a little bit of money. Let me go ahead and sell that. Maybe. God, I'm not getting anything for it, though. Ah, I'm going to keep it for now. I'll keep it for now. I keep changing my mind. All right. What? What? Oh, did I sell all my compost? I must not have had very much. Okay, go ahead. Mm. 
Okay, you can take off. Take off, you hoser. And then uh, let's find my other my other rig, which is here. What do I have that set up in? Let me put that in group four. Right there. Right. Right. It's a lot easier to head out on the road without all that traffic. Got a new version of this truck. I showed it to you in another episode of one of the uh, one of the other, probably San Diego, Carmen Santiago, or Don Diego, whichever it is. Uh, it's the cab over version. I have both versions. I mean, not, uh, the conventional version. I have both versions of cab over or conventional. I like the conventional better than the cab overs. Although in real life, when I was driving truck, I drove both of them. Believe it or not, the cab over is a little easier to drive because you can see more. You're, you're sitting right over the, uh, the front axle. That's why they call it a cab over. And that front end of the truck really sticks out a ways. So in real life, it's actually easier to drive the other one. Now, where's my other trailer? Um... No, wait a minute. Did I not have... Did I not have the other trailer that went with this? Uh-oh. Maybe I don't. Well, that's odd. I thought I did. Hang on. Let me go to the garage. See what I got in trailers. Okay, I have those two campies. Campies. And by golly, I might not. I got the truck. I didn't buy the trailer. Holy smokes, I thought I did. wonder how much it is. Um, it's 40000 I'm going to get it, even though I'm trying to spare money, but I'm going to get that. And then let me have that delivered. Uh, yeah, let's have that delivered. Let's see. I need to get something else, too. Hang on. Here, here I'm trying to save money to buy, and I keep spending. What the hell's wrong with me? Okay, so let me see. How much is the forage wagon that I'm looking at? Forage wagon. Be this uh, funny looking thing here. It's only $800. I'm buying that. Okay, you won't believe this thing. This thing's unbelievable. Let me get that delivered. FedEx probably charged me more for delivery costs than it would be to buy the thing right there. Okay, this thing is weird. Let me grab Enterprise, if I can find Enterprise. Where is it? There's Enterprise. Let's grab Enterprise. Now, unfortunately, Enterprise can't really pull this thing. And I'll show you why in a minute. It can, but it can't in the long run. I know, I'm talking confusing. I'm confusing you. Well, can it or can't it? Well, it can and it can't. It can do both. All right, now this thing is unbelievable. Let me show you this. I'm going to run down to this grass field that I made. This thing, I have no idea how much this thing holds. But it's millions. It's... I, I don't know what it holds. But... 
it's a lot. And that's why Enterprise can't pull it. Because after it picks up so much grass, it gets too heavy. So Enter Enterprise will pretty much just stop at some point. So you need a healthy thing to pull it with. On uh, my uh, play version, my personal play version of of uh, Don Diego, I pull it with Big Bud. Because Big Bud's powerful. Big Bud is slow, slower than a seven-year itch, but it's powerful. Now, let me see here. We've got uh, uh, grass. Where's grass? Grass. Grass north. Grass north to farm. I think that's it right there. And we're not going to be able to go very far. No, where is it? It's way down yonder, I think. But as you can see, it's kind of weird looking. Notice it's got its own windrow. <laughs> it's got its own windrower attached to it. It's freaky looking. Looks like a grasshopper or something. What I should call it, grasshopper. Okay. All right, I think this is the start right here. So let's get this thing started. It's not gonna go very far, but let's get it started. I have no idea how much that thing holds, but it's a heck of a lot. The most I've gotten in it, wait, where are you going? The most I've gotten in it is uh, two million, and then Big Bud had to come and take over. All right, drive the course, see what it does. All right, I'm going to let that go, but it's unbelievable, this thing. It's, <laughs> it's funny. It doesn't show anything in it, though. I've had two million volume of grass in there, and it's still empty. It still shows empty. Nothing comes in it. Weird. Weird. It's really weird. All right, what are we doing here? Is Potato Guy done? Oh, he is. All right, we'll get this guy unloaded and then we'll get that cedar going up here. Yeah, I really like the big bud, but it is slow. It only goes 19 miles an hour, period. But if you put the cedar on the back of it, it only goes nine miles an hour. So on these big fields like this, oh man, it would take forever to seed the thing or do anything on it using Big Bud. All right, we're gonna put this guy to work. Uh, I don't know what I need. I'm gonna be selling everything. So let's see what I need. Let me see what I need. All right, uh, I'm going to be selling the wheat. I don't have barley. Uh, canola, sunflower seeds. Ah. Ah. I tell you what, I think I'm going to do sunflower seeds because I can use those for the pig feed or soybeans. One of the two. One of the two, one of the two, one of the two. Let's do soybeans. Okay, I'm going to do soybeans here because I'm going to be selling everything else I've got. So this this will take care of that. All right, so let's see here. Let's switch this over to soybeans. I'm just going to hire a worker. There we go. Who do we got? We got Craig. All right, let me get this other stuff out of the way here. Okay, he's there. Get him out of there. Move, 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 move. Let's get him uh, drive now. That'll take him off. All right, let's go find our. Uh oh. Shoot. Move it. Move it or lose it. All 
All right. And then let's go find our other truck and trailer. And let's swap out for... Let's stop him and... Let's swap out for wheat. And make some money. I only got a little less than half of what I need. Well, actually, I got quite a bit less than half. I've only got about a third of what I need for that field. It's so expensive. I'm going to stop him. And we're going to we're going to get rid of that. We're going to put this over to t uh, transport. Uh, and then we're going to do grain to sell point. And we're going to call this potatoes. All right. And then let's just line her up here. Get our other truck. It's a weird sound. No, I didn't even come close to duplicating the sound. Hey, right, go man, go. Now the other guy should just take over. And let's see, let me get, let me get, Where's my other truck? Let me put this in number four, because this is the one I use for working around the farm here. I'm going to go get the other trailer for this. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, I got to go check on Enterprise. Maybe bogged down already. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this rear trailer here and I'm going to fill it with, oops, I'm going to fill it with potatoes because I don't want to sell all my potatoes. So I'll put uh, something in this truck here. But I gotta go check on Enterprise. What what do I have Enterprise in? Unassigned. Let's put him in uh, four for now, I guess. Maybe, maybe five. Okay, uh, it's got seven percent in it. I don't know if that counter is right. I don't know how much this thing holds, but it's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. And I can't afford to buy Big Bud. Big Bud's expensive. I can't afford to buy Big Bud to pull this, so I'm going to have to pull it with that fent. And so I can't get it too full. Okay, they're selling potatoes. Uh, that was... Selling potatoes. He's doing his his thing of seeding. Oh boy, these fence don't hold a lot of gas. They run out of gas uh, pretty fast. Well, fuel. They don't use gas. It's a diesel rig, but they run out of that very quickly. So there you go. Okay, let me get this guy in potatoes. What else do I have, though, that I might want not want to sell all of? Um, I don't think I want to sell all the canola, either. And that's all I have, isn't it? Okay. Let's do a load of, uh, of uh, canola. Wow. No, you know what? 
stop that because I'm doing soybeans. I don't need canola. Let's put potatoes in that back one. All right, let's do potatoes there. Let me check on my two trailers. Uh-oh. Oh, are you kidding? Oh, you guys, they don't play nice. Oh, stop. They just do not play well together. Uh, come on. Oh, man. I can't afford to lose that crop. I want to get my cats back. The Kenworths do fine, but they cause problems with with uh, some of the trailers and stuff. They do the same thing with the crampy trailers, by the way. Uh-oh. There went my daylight. Come on, moonlight. I can't see. I'm going to have to do a uh, kamikaze on this. Ramming speed. All right, ramming speed. There we go. There we go. Let me see if I can latch onto it now. Oh, I can't see. There we go. Come on, daylight. Let me see if I can glom onto this thing. Okay. Give this thing a little four-wheel drive if I can. Whoa, what happened? Is this the... Oh, uh, Kenworths don't do four-wheel drive, do they? No, that was another reason. The Kenworths you can't put four-wheel drive on. The cats you can. But I can't afford to do it right now. I'll have to wait. I'm going to have to lease some fields and make some money here. If I can. I can't remember how much it costs to lease fields in this game. In this On this map. Let me see. Like, if I was going to do 17... Okay, so it's 215000 But it's a $3,000... A uh, three million dollar field, so I guess two fifteen isn't too bad, really. So I could I could actually afford to uh, lease a couple fields and uh, and make a little money. That's why that's how I made my money in Don Diego. I took in between episodes, I just leased about five or six of those huge fields and uh, and harvested them, and I made enough money to buy what I needed to buy. San Diego's not so bad though. I mean, you can lease a field for sixty thousand. A pretty good sized field. Alright, now let's get this guy up there. Okay, I got one million. I'm a little over a third of the way. All right, let's sell this. I think I, I might have been fine on this if I hadn't have sent both trucks off at the same time. I think that's what happened. Before one of it could empty, the other one came and rammed him or something. I don't know. Find out when they come back. All right, let's get back to this fella. Let's get rid of the canola I've got in here. And we'll just keep these potatoes. Oh boy, I gotta go check on Enterprise. Let me go check on Enterprise. 
Where is Enterprise? There. Enterprise is getting pretty slow. I think I'm going to stop it. Let me stop Enterprise here. And uh, put that guy away. Let me swap to Enterprise and stop him. And then... Let me... There's no way I'm going to get back to the farm with this. It'd take me all day. Let me just... Uh, unhook line this back up here and I'm gonna let Enterprise go without the trailer and then when I get that fent unlodged from uh, any other job I'll bring the fent down and empty that trailer which reminds me let me check on that see done kind of Sorta. Of. Ooh, almost went down the mud hole. All right, first thing I need to do is go back and fill this up with fuel. check and see if I have any pig food. If I remember right, in the last episode, I filled up the pig, well, I didn't fill it up. I put stuff in the pig food maker. And hopefully I've got a little bit of pig food because I've actually fed the pigs nothing. Hell, on Don Diego on my playthrough that I'm not recording, I, I looked the other day, I had 900 pigs. I started off with uh, 200 and just was playing my game. Hadn't checked it for a couple days. Man, those pigs were making bacon like you wouldn't believe. I like the fact that they took collision off this thing right here. You just drive right through it. I love it. Little things in life. All right, now let's run and get our pick em up truck. And what I can do, if I get enough uh, grass going, I'm just gonna start making a real uh, stockpile of, gra of silage. And then I'm just gonna start selling silage. So let's go back to him, run him up here. I do have the mod on here that at midnight it washes all my equipment. You notice uh, that that was pretty dirty. That piece of equipment's all clean now. So let's see. He's empty. What happened here? Oh my god. See what I mean? They're just not playing well together. The other guy just rammed him. Just rammed him. Dang it. I don't like it when things don't work right. Yeah. Let me go check this. Make sure he's gonna empty out all right. I would think if they emptied out a little faster or loaded a little faster. Alright, let's see if this guy at least empties out okay. 
They must be emptying out okay because I made a couple hundred thousand on that last trip. Uh, okay, this guy's on the road. That other guy's got to empty out before he gets there. Maybe I'm coming in too fast. Because these guys... Maybe that's it. I'm coming in too fast. Oh, I'm going to have to redo that. The Kenworths aren't able to slow it down enough. Yeah, that's that's an issue. Okay. Um, I can redo it, or what I could do would be to slow them down. Street speed, right there. Let's uh, let's see if I can slow them down. Speed from recording from recording. Street speed, yeah, they're way, going way, way too fast. Let me just slow them down, and then what I'll do is I'll... I can remake it. If I remake it, I can drive as fast as I want up to a point, and then make sure that I slow them way down. Okay, from recording... Let's just slow it way down till I can remake those courses. I want them to go faster when they're on the freeway, but I didn't slow them down uh, soon enough when they got to the cell point. That might be what caused that problem in the first place. But we'll find out. Let's get this guy back to the farm. And then I'm going to go down and check on the pig food. If I don't get this guy stuck in a mud hole. Darn mud. Like I said, the mud was kind of fun for about five minutes. Now it's kind of a pain in the butt. Plus the fact I had to start my game over to take advantage of the mud. And I haven't looked. There may be a newer version again. I haven't looked. I have to confess, I haven't been gaming much in the last week. It's the day before Mother's Day. It's Saturday today that I'm recording. And I absolutely have not one single video to put online because I've been playing, just playing and not recording for the last week and a half. Uh, while I'm reading audiobooks, listening to audiobooks, and just enjoying life. <laughs> I haven't recorded anything. I told my wife, I said, I'm going to have to do a little recording today if you want me to have Mother's Day off, because I have absolutely nothing to put up. All righty. So let's see, let me grab, let me grab this guy, head down to the pig farm. Actually, I don't have any reason to drive this guy down there. Let me just run down there. There's the sheepies. And that's a big sheep pen. Okay, let's see what we got here. I'm missing something. I don't have any corn. Oh, so it's not making pig food. Doggone it. I should have just planted corn. I have no corn. Um, what else did you used to be able to use? Soybeans. I can use soybeans, which I don't have any of those either. All right. But I just planted soybeans, so we're getting closer to having pig food. We're getting close. 
One more harvest I'll have. Soybeans. Probably wouldn't hurt to plant corn too, I guess, but we'll see. All righty, I think I'm going to call it an episode here. We're up to almost uh, one and a half million, and it's about halfway to what I need. I don't know how many crops I've got left. I'm out of wheat. I've got a little bit of corn left. I've got some canola I can sell. I don't think I'm going to make enough to buy that farm. So what I'm going to do, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. I might, I might lease some fields and harvest them to make enough money to buy that field. Um, what's he doing? All right, let's put him to work. Drive now. So I'm going to call it here. I hope you had fun. Uh, if you did, give it a like, share it with a friend, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you on the farm in the next episode. Happy farming.